Hey everyone, so today I'm going to the dentist and I'm going to get in these teeth sorted out, let it focus. Right, this tooth here, as you can see, there's a little, a little dent. Then this one, here, I actually chipped it on holiday. Well, I say I, I was on holiday and some boy basically knocked a bottle in my mouth and it chipped my tooth. So, I know you're going to be watching this later, so thanks for that. But, um, it doesn't matter, it's my fault anyway as well. But, um... I'm going to get them sorted today, and then I think we're going to be talking about bottom wounds align. My bottom teeth aren't too bad, so I'm not too sure if I'm going to go ahead with it. But I'm definitely going to look into the options today. So I'm going to go to Stratford House Dental. I will vlog the whole trip today, and you'll watch me get a little makeover on my teeth. As you can see, my teeth, as you can see, see, my teeth are naturally like really, I say naturally, but I use Crest Whitening Strips. People say not to use them because they're so strong, but... I love them. As you see, that my teeth are really white anyway. But, um, yeah. Let's go ahead with today. And this is Matilda. Did you eat my retainers? Did you eat them? You, are you naughty? Oh, she wants to cuddle. <laughs> How can you tell her off when she looks this cute? Anyway, so... I will keep everybody updated with how it all goes today and how it's all going to work. So yeah. Don't lick me! Just done my makeup! So as you can see, it's lovely weather in England today. But I'm a little dentist. So this is my dentist. You have to walk around. I need to put my mask on. And then I think you just wait here. So I'm just getting out of here. Come on. <laughs> So we just got my before photos and I'm now laying down on the bed. <laughs> no, it's not too hot. I think I could go out like this on the 21st of June. <laughs> <laughs> Might get a few steps. Mm -hmm. um, no, have, how did you check? So these are the afters. As you can see, they're so much more straight. I'm so happy with them, like, and I'm not sure if everyone else can see the difference, but like, it's a big difference to me, because I just, I just thought my teeth looked like children's teeth, but um, I'm so happy with them, and they've matched the colour perfectly, I don't even know how they've done that, in no way, my lips have gone a bit crusty now, because I had to this thing over my mouth and open it up, but um, so happy with it, next, we have spoke about the Invisalign for the bottom, but I think I'm going to wait till next month, but yeah. I love them! Look at the marks on my head. And I also got my new retainer. I will show you guys. So this is my new retainer. And I like this one because it's really thin. Like it's not really like thick. My other one was really thick. So I'm very happy with this one. He told me to pull it off from the back. Like love it. So happy! I'm so happy with the way my teeth have such, um, turned out. As you can see now, there's no like marks, they're just a lot more straight. And he's done it in a really natural way, which I really like as well. See, I wanted to get like composite bonding done or like get veneers one day and stuff like that, but then I just thought, like, I actually love my teeth. Like, I'm so lucky to have such healthy teeth that are like naturally like quite white as well. So. Now I've got to think about my bottom. They're a bit wonky, but like, I just don't know if it's like worth the money paying out for now. So I might wait a bit and see how it goes before I invest into that. Because if I do go traveling this year, then I just feel like I won't wear my retainer properly again. But this little one, I feel like I can just live with because it's like nice and thin. But yeah, peace out. Right, just to start off, we missed our train because of Poppy. Not only have we missed a train, her nail has fallen off. My phone is stuck on that. Her phone is stuck on Casey. It's, it's just, it's not going well today. It's not going well already. Oh my God, look at my hair. Oh no. We've now got a roll. Don't even show you this. <laughs> Probably not having a good day so far. <laughs> she forgot her. No, you didn't forget your makeup. The makeup art's cancelled on her. 
and we've now got a half hour drive to check Ruffles. We're supposed to be there in 10 minutes. So yeah, this will be fun. And Poppy's now hungry as well. Sherry. The night is so bad. It is so bad. The reason I haven't posted anything about like the shoot that day was because my camera died when we was there so I couldn't actually record anything else which is so annoying because we literally just got there but I just forgot to charge it but yeah that's why there was nothing else left from that day but when the photos are up I'm sure Poppy will post them so keep an eye out on her Instagram. Hey so as you can see I've literally just got out of the shower not long ago and my hair's all wet still so please bear with me but it's the night before my mum's 40th birthday and tonight me and my sister are going to blow up loads of balloons. Um, my nan has paid for this to come so I can't take gratitude for this but it's like big 40 and it's got her name on it. No it doesn't. No it does. Yeah it's got her name on this balloon. It's gorgeous. I'm so lucky. Well she's so lucky like what we have planned is going to be so good and i know she's going to love it so keep tuned because you're going to see some good i just want to show everyone how we are doing the helium has got too cold we can't blow any more balloons up and we've discovered if you put the some of the balloons it just, it just falls down, down to the floor. but this is the plan to have these go down the hallway and then these all be in here so we'll let you know how it all goes. So I think she's going to love this. There's like so many photos of us on holiday. There's so many balloons. And I'm gonna go through and that's gonna be there. And then the balloon arch might go here or we might put it in the den. But um, yeah, let's go. Right, so we're now trying to put the balloons into the arch. Millie just found this. There are so many balloons. So basically, you put it in the big bit there and then you pull it through. These are all the photos. And then we've got more photos around. And then big 40 balloon, more photos. And then this massive balloon arch from Amazon that literally costs 20 pounds, I think. Result. Hey, so today I'm at my mum's and I've got so much to record. I've got to do a sheen haul and I've got some pretty little thing stuff, some boohoo stuff that I want to look at. Wanted to make TikToks and stuff on it, but I don't think I'm going to have enough time today. I have to go out at 12 45. But um, I just got my, um, my new Converse from JD. And this is how they came, like literally in a bag. Wait, this is really hard to do. But they literally came just like this. Like fair enough with my shoes, but I don't know why. It's like the box is ripped and stuff. I just expected JD to have better packaging. I don't know, sorry if you just got my dress. But anyway, these are my cute little yellow trainers. I thought they're really nice for summer and I love that these will go with this outfit. I love this outfit so much. But yeah, let me, um, I'm going to start going through all the sheen stuff and everything that I've got and I can show you a few bits that I have. There's my PLT order that they sent me. I'm not even too sure like what I got, I forgot. I always forget like what I have. It's like Christmas all the time. So let me go ahead with this and I will show you everything that I've got from all these brands. As I was just recording, the delivery man came with um, my other parcel. So my ASOS has just arrived. Um, these are my yellow new shoes. 
absolutely love them. And then Pretty Little Thing has just arrived. It's a huge parcel, but I'm gonna open it all up and I think I'll post this all on my story. But this is like what it's like every like every week for me. And it's just, there's so much stuff you need to go through. I need to open it, try it on, make like TikToks with it and stuff. And then I would normally like just try and style it. And then I have to plan outfits where I'm gonna take photos in it and stuff. So it's all a massive long process, but just want to show you a bit of an insight of how my week goes. <laughs> so today has been a long day of filming Sheen. Had a bit of work with my mum and I sorted out all my clothes. I kind of like saw what I've got and tried a few bits on. So tomorrow I'm going to make some tutorial like hauls and yeah, let's see how this goes. Good morning everyone, I hope you are all well. So today I have already, I've washed my hair, I've used the, that horse shampoo, I forgot what it's called, but I'll find out for you and I'll like pop it around. But I've used that to wash my hair today and yes, I've already tied it up. I know it's not good to tie your hair up when you've just washed it, but hey ho. Can you see my nose is already red? That's how cold it is in this flat. I don't even know why it's cold, like all the heaters are on. I don't know if it's just me. But this morning I've also cleaned my room. This is it cleaned. There's my little doggy. <laughs> so I've cleaned my room. Everything's like hung up. Earlier today, like this was all on the floor. There was so much stuff. I sleep with like clothes on my bed sometimes and it's just ridiculous. Like I should never do that. And then now I'm going to be doing a Courtney Black workout. She honestly, like, is amazing. Like, amazing. My friend who does boxing, he, um, he done the workout with me. And he was like, what the hell? Like, that was so intense. And I was like, yeah. Like, you want to see your little workout? This is hard. So I've got my set up already. <laughs> she literally follows me everywhere. Every time I bloody try to do anything, she's with me. But um, I'm now going to do that and I think I'll show you a few snips of like what I do and stuff, but yeah. This is the shampoo that I use, it's called Mane and Tail and Body. Honestly, it's so good, it makes my hair feel so thick. I remember using it before I got my hair extensions put back in and I saw a difference within a week. Like, the texture of my hair, it's, it doesn't like smell really nice, but like, it doesn't smell bad. So I always make sure I have like a really nice like conditioner after. To be fair, I should probably get a conditioner for it, but um, we'll see. I've never tried it. Has anyone anyone ever tried it? And then I also done a crest whitening strip on my teeth. That's why I feel like they look so white today. They're literally standing out so much. But yeah, crest whitening strips are the one. One of these hula hoops from the range. It's one of those weighted ones, and I got it for 9 99 It was literally £10. So what I normally do is I just do around 10 minutes. I've seen people do it for like half hour a day, but I just do it for like 10 minutes just to help me with my waist. And I, it's like an ab workout as well. So yeah, I just do this for around 10 minutes a day, and then I do my Courtney Black workout. I'm sitting here and I just really want sushi. Should I just go and get it? I don't know. Should I go and get sushi? She's always next to me. She's so cute. Oh my god. It looks like I've just woke up. I've been up literally since 10. I had the best dream ever. I don't even really remember it. But I know like I kept going to wake up. And I was like I can't. I need to finish this dream. But it's annoying because I must have finished it. And then forgot what happened. So oh well. So I just want to show everyone what I eat basically on a daily basis. Chicken nuggets and chips. I then get some peri salt and then I get cheese all over it. But that's basically all I eat. I don't really like eat anything healthy, which is really annoying. I had a mission yesterday, go and find some sushi. I had to go to, I went Waitrose, no sushi. Went Yo Sushi, they're shut, but they said they were open. Then had to go to Sainsbury's, and thank God they had it there. But when you get it later on in the evening, it's not as fresh, so that was quite annoying. But oh well, I've come to the end of the week now, so I guess these videos are gonna stop soon. All morning, I've been editing YouTube videos, which is take, I don't like remember, how, like, they take this long, that made no sense. I forgot how long these YouTube videos make, especially hauls when you're having to tag 
all the clothes and like where they're from and stuff. It's so annoying. But as long as you guys love them, then I'll carry on. My bottom is, says I'm bothered. Yeah, outfit for today. Me and Poppy are going to a photo shoot. We need to drive to, oh, we've got tan on. Look at my tan, I'm ready up. <laughs> I look so orange. We need to drive to Watford first, get our makeup to her, huh? Did you wash yours off? I washed mine off, but not on my face. I just applied it on my face. My face was so pale. So we're gonna drive to Watford, get our makeup done, and then go to London for the shoot. So come and watch it with us today. Just had my makeup done. I haven't got the lipstick yet because I'm doing a lipstick before we leave, but looking good. Poppy's just waiting for her. <laughs> <laughs> just finished my hair. So now all of our makeups and hair are all done. Um, just gonna get ready and then we're gonna drive to the studio now. It's. Do you wanna get your face in? Hi guys. Lovely makeup artist, Zoe. Covid safe. Covid safe, don't worry. Everyone's got a negative test. Everyone's got a negative, and I got my vaccine. And it is for work. <laughs> um, so yeah, now just going to the other side of London, which is gonna take an hour because there's traffic as well. But I think we want to stop at McDonald's because yes, Pop, Kelly, some, yeah, some of us have a note. But yeah, all right, we'll see how it all goes. So we're now all in my car, just about, <laughs> and we're about to drive to East London. Let's go. We think we're here, but we're not too sure. My car sounds like it's about to blow up. Why we, while I was driving, guess what happened? We saw this tire literally just like bouncing on the road, and we were like, "What the hell?" Didn't we? we saw the bouncing tire. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nearly killed us, but didn't. And then yeah, so now we're just trying to wait and hug it in. We are half hour late, but. We're women, so we're always late. So now we've got in the studio, we're all going up. <laughs> Lovely gentleman took my bag. <laughs> Alright, so. Did I just walk in as well? No. Thank you so much. Oh my god, I love it! Right, here is so cute. <laughs> Guess you forgot to record everything again. Oh, no, only I forgot to record everything. This is the aftermath. Uh, and Pop's lost his socks. Everyone is now tired. I'm ready to go home.